Hello Analyst. Hi, I just got your email about this Abacus presentation. I am confused about it. Analyst, why do you always bother me? Just do what Mr. P tells you to do. How are we going to sell this? Most of these mortgages are owned by people who don't have jobs. Why are we so keen on making abandoned properties the majority of the bundle? I went to business school. You did not. The investors like me. They will listen to me. If anyone opens up the files, they will see this is all worthless. One of the mortgages is a front house where the student reported his income at a billion dollars. Another mortgage file just has a slip of paper that says, I promise to pay this back after my screenplay sells. Who wrote these mortgages? My friend did. He works downstairs. He wears suspenders because he makes a lot of money. His cufflinks are the price of a small car. Wow, I am impressed. Yes, you should be. Listen analyst, we are doing God's work. Don't worry, I am going to golf with the Moody's analyst. I will also take out the S&P guy to Peter Lugers. We pay them a fee you know. This is crazy. Just like that, they slap on AAA. Don't worry, nobody does due diligence anyways. It's not my fault. As they say, carpe diem. You mean caveat emptor? Whatever. French was never my strong suit. Well, what should I write about his involvement? Analyst, just write that. Mr. P, a super investor, carefully selected these mortgages himself. Your mother must be so proud of you. Analyst, what is our motto? We put our client's interests first. And who is our client? Mr. P. Yes. Now get out of my office.